This is exactly the kind of thing the therapist was talking about. You died again. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another episode brought to you by Games Liches. In this episode we're gonna show you how to kill the four horsemen extremely easy and get the loot. No more worrying about those goddamn explosive cars, no more worrying about a lot of the mobs. Just sit back, enjoy the fight and just kill them. This is not a glitch video, this is a legit strategy. So without any further ado, let's enjoy the strategy and please note I am gonna have to speed it up because the entire fight was about 18 minutes long and I really doubt you wanna watch that much. So it's going to be sped up as I explain things through it. Right here you would start as normal, you would jump over the bus, then you would head left and don't aggro any of the mobs. Now you would need to jump up on this remaining like truck crate or whatever, two people take cover on each side. Or all four people can take cover on one side but we found that a little annoying because it becomes a clusterfuck ladies and gentlemen. Here you just have to kill these two millies that are charging you and then just make sure that two people always run immunizer, one on each side, and two people always run smart cover. And as you could see here, the cars can't get to us. The only other thing that you have to sometimes worry about is the gas grenades. That's pretty much it. So the technique that I found that works the best is you pop the uh, smart cover and then you would pop your heel right under you. So basically your smart cover recharges quickly and I'm sure you're already aware of that tactic. Everyone is. And as you could see here, we're just sitting back and killing all the mobs. You know, please excuse again the fact that this video is sped up. It's sped up for the reasons that otherwise it becomes uh, almost a 20 minute video and I really doubt you guys want to watch it. You know, and right here my friend Otters, you know, didn't put the immunizer and that's what happens. You kind of end up burning. The car's explosion does not hurt you, but the fire still can. That's why it requires to have immunizers. Also, please note that the gas grenades can actually destroy the immunizers. So what we were dropping the immunizers behind us on a red containers. Like if you guys, when you guys get a chance, there's uh, going to be a red container be uh, to my left hand side behind us. That's where we were dropping the immunizers to uh, have them avoid being destroyed. Now this is already the second uh, wave where more engineers come out and you don't really even got to concern yourself with them. You know, you just kind of kill them off real quick because their cars is the what's the most dangerous things about them. Their shotgun damage isn't even that significant. All you got to do is just make sure guys, make sure that you got immunizer and you got smart cover up. If you don't have those up, you're going to die. The two people with the highest electronics have to run smart cover. Two people with the lowest electronics have to run the immunizer because you're not looking for the heal out of the immunizer, you're just plainly looking for the effect out of it. You know, I'm sorry for rambling, I, uh, while you're watching this I would love to explain the strategy, you know, so you guys can see. Because from this point on, we're going to get to the four horsemen. And the four horsemen, the way we do them, is quite, quite very, very easy. Is we take them down, basically uh, all of them down, uh, to one bar of HP while kiting them in a clockwise rotation or counterclockwise. It's really irrelevant. It's w whichever rotation you want. The reason why I am Alpharius had to go down over there is because his healing abilities and his skills got locked up for some reason. And so you guys, if that happens to you, like on anywhere in division where your skills completely lock up, you, you would either have to A, relog or die, die, meaning fully die and get fully recovered. Just crawling, dying does not fix it. At least not for me or anybody I know this is actually an ongoing issue and I really hope they're going to uh, fix it you know same thing as dying or popping heal and it's not going off you know it's also a massive issue that needs to be fixed as you can see here we're just picking off the mobs and now we're going to start kiting the mini bosses Right here, death is going to come out of, I mean, I'm sorry, war is going to come out from behind. I'm going to run around war, have him target me, and my friends are going to shoot him in the back. So to take his HP down really quick, please know we're doing this on heroic, not challenging, not hard. This is the mode that came out on July 21st, the heroic mode. 
now we're going to run over here and to create further distance from them as you could see there all the bosses are now clustering and far now we're just going to start picking off the bo one bosses at a time from this point on i'll just let you guys enjoy and watch how we actually kite these four bosses around and what strategy we use Again, this is not a glitch, this is not an exploit, this is just basically us using uh, the mechanics of the game properly, so to speak. You know, enjoy the rest of the video. If you guys, you know, want to check out my usual crazy endings, you could just skip to the end, you know, enjoy the fun and laughter there. If in as usual, if you enjoyed this video, please click like, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I'll see you all in the next Division video.